for this project you'll need maybe need a little pliers, a pair of scissors, aluminum foil tape, there it is, um, used Christmas lights that don't no longer light up as a string. And what I do is I pull the pull the individual lights out, actually get them out of their socket, and you can test them on the batteries. Let's uh, turn this off. Now you can test this on the battery. This one I know is good, so it should light up. They're touchy sometimes on getting the the right connection. <coughs> I don't know, some of these wires may be corroded. So you have to play with it a little. There it goes. Try it again. It's easier with the lights on actually. Anyways, take more for us, but you, you get the picture. Okay, here's here I wired these uh, these three in parallel. So when you hook the battery to it, they glow fairly brightly. You have 12 volts going across each one of the ones that are in parallel. Now, this next one's in series, so there's joints. Turn the light out for a second. There's breaks between here and here. The bulb completes the breaks. The bulb completes the brake. The bulb completes the brake. Here's like a mini switch that goes across there. Foil the foil, see? All right, so this one's a two-hand deal. I've got to hold this down and apply the battery. You can see how much dimmer these are because there's only three volts dropped on each. There they go. Hold on a second. There they go. Alright. There's only three volts dropped on each one in series. You have nine volts going across three, so there's three volts on each one. Now if we come back over here and see how bright this one is, the ones wired in parallel. And you can do a little experiment on the ones in series <coughs> by if we can get them to light again. Like I said, it's hard working the camera in doing this at the same time. There they go. All right, see how they see how they're fairly dim. They move them up here. Now you got four and a half volts across each one because you're cutting out the first one out of the circuit. Now you can actually get the brightest possible deal. This is be like the one that we tested. I don't know if you can tell. Yeah, that's how bright that one is. You have all nine volts going across the one, and you have no foil interfering with it like you do on these. It's actually even brighter than the ones in parallel because you have no resistance from the foil. Anyways, that's it. Thanks for watching.